It's quite ingenious, really, when you consider this technology is uh, well over 50 years old, if not more. Uh, on the drive here, I have a, a worm gear, and the worm gear hooked up to a helically cut uh, gear, which uh, onto another worm gear here, uh, and that's going to turn this cog here, which in turn is going to wind on the hours. So as I turn that there now, we can see that 0.5 change to a 0.6 and we can keep going and eventually that would move over to 0.7 so quite incredible really how it works and the hair spring inside here obviously that needs to be calibrated um, quite accurately obviously doing what I'm doing there now is decalibrating the instrument so here's the drag cupper assembly uh, it's all it is is an aluminium cup it has, has a hair spring and that hair spring allows the uh, the cup to uh, return back to the zero position. So as the magnet rotates, it creates eddy currents, and those currents created inside that cup try to rotate and catch up with the magnet. And obviously the faster the magnet spins, the more currents are produced, the more that will turn, and eventually as the RPM decreases, that will just return back to zero. Here inside the, uh, the, gear, the mechanism, all I've got there is a circular magnet which is rotating and that magnet, balanced perfectly, is rotating inside that cup and the two quite simply go together like that.